I should try to stay out of sight.
I knew you'd come find me sooner or later. What tipped you off? You killed my soldiers, but... You helped my family when I couldn't. Even if we're apart, I know they're safe thanks to you. It's the least I could do. The world is so chaotic now. The cult made it that way. We're living in divided times. Sparta against Athens. Old against new. <laughs> and do you think the cultists aren't stoking the flames on both sides? I've seen what they can do. What they're willing to do. I want what's best for Arcavia. I'll consider what you have to say. It's not too late. Leave the cult of Cosmos and join Brasidas. You expect me to trust you? After how you slaughter the monger? I know what you do to cultists. I won't bow my head just for you to cut it off. That wasn't my plan. Then I should thank you for letting me face death as Spartans do. I need to stay hidden. Dead. This complicates things. One less cultist seems simple enough. La Rose was a dear friend once. I should have been there. I'm sorry, Brasidas. But when Logos joined the cult, he sealed his fate. So you execute the manga in public against my advice, and now you kill La Rose? If you were under my command, you wouldn't be anymore. I don't follow orders. I do what I have to. So it's done. I suppose you'll be wanting to report the news to Sparta soon. You're right. We've done all we can. It's time to go to Sparta. Yes, it's time we returned. Marini, 
You are as determined as ever. I'm sure you will regain your house soon. With Lagos dead, arrangements must be made to ensure Sparta doesn't starve. Arcadia is safe once more. And the bounty is lifted. We are free to travel without fear. Then let's continue our journey. I'm here to face the kings. Are you ready to take back our family's land? Of course. But my purpose here is to bring down the cultist king. You make your mother proud, Alexios. But are you sure you have enough proof to accuse him? I'm sure. I'll gather the Afors and meet you in the throne room. Who are the Afors? You don't remember? Then again, you were only a child. The five Ephors are elected from the citizens of Sparta. They have power over even the kings. You need to convince them if you wish to save Sparta from the cult's control. See you in the throne room. <sighs> what are we waiting for? Sorry to keep you waiting. You summoned the Air Force? You must have achieved some success to earn this adoring crowd. The Athenian forces in Viotia are no more. The land is yours. That's excellent news! I suppose you were too busy conquering territory to bring our champion to the Olympic Games. I brought him to Elise, but... He had an accident at sea, so I entered the games myself and won a wreath for Sparta. By Nike! Well done, champion. If you have nothing but good news to share, why did you call for the Air Force? We were told serious charges would be brought. Serious charges? Against whom? You act as if you don't know. Against you, Pausanias. Sparta must be rid of Pafsanias before it's too late. He's a member of the cult of Cosmos, and a traitor to Sparta. A Cosmos cult? What are you going on about? Is this some kind of joke? I have the proof. Right here. Your proof is right there! You know he's guilty! This isn't proof of anything. 
Ethos should only be called upon for serious matters. This lack of evidence is a waste of our time and disrespectful to the thrones of Sparta. The accuser should be made an example of for all other reckless fools. I taught him poorly. Punish me as his mother instead. We gave you every chance to prove yourself. Invited you back for a royal audience. And this is how you repay us? What say you, Archidamus? Alexios and Marini of Agiad. Your names are cursed. May the Cryptia hunt you, and the Elote scrape the meat from your bones! Agreed. A wise ruling. Too bad you don't have a mask or a black cloak to save you this time. You're there? In their feet? <laughs> Afsanias revealed himself before I was dragged out of there. So he is the cultist king. It would be wise to deal with him as soon as possible. I will. When you've dealt with him, meet me at home. With pleasure. Ares has chosen me to lead the Spartans to glory. There can only be one. Pafsanias is part of the cult of Cosmos. I'll have to kill him myself. There's Pafsanias. Malaka.
Alexios! You are condemned to be hunted! I should have been more certain before accusing Pausanias. He is a plague on Sparta and its territories. And you say you are sure now? Where is he? So he can defend himself. I watched him die. You murdered him? Yes. I found proof he was a member of the Cult of Cosmos. Undeniable proof. This letter was written and signed by Pausanias' own hand, outlining the progress of their plans in Sparta. What is this Cult of Cosmos? You've mentioned them over and over, as if I should know. They are a secret group with one goal. To seize power. They're using this war to strengthen their position. I find it difficult to think Papsineus was using Sparta this whole time. We've ruled together for years. I'll speak with the Air Force to confirm what you say. But if it's true, you deserve to be called a Spartan citizen once more. And of course, your family home is yours again. Thank you. One more thing. Yes? Should you decide to rule Sparta yourself, at least let me face you in battle. <laughs> I'm not made for ruling, my king. It's gone. What's gone? There was a skull here, a small rabbit skull, from your first hunt. Why would someone take that? There is only one person who would have taken it. Nikolaos. Maybe seeing each other again made him think of this place. He did the same to me. Seems I wasn't the only one yearning for home. I hope I'm not intruding. Rasidas, come in. It's good to see the two of you back home. It feels good to be here. You're here instead of in training. What's wrong? I'm heading to Pilos as soon as I can. I think you may want to come as well. I'd be happy to return the favor. What's waiting for us in Pilos? Glory. The Athenians are pushing the Spartans back even as we speak. It would be a devastating loss for Sparta, and I can't allow that to happen. Sounds like you've lost confidence in Sparta's warriors. They're as strong as they've ever been. But now they're facing a power they can't even imagine. Do you mean Vimos? Yes, that's what the rumors say. A force of nature in the body of a mortal who can cut down any soldier in her path. If Vimos is in Pylos, we have to stop her. I'll wait for you at the ship, but be quick. Each moment we waste is another Spartan dead. Cassandra is in Pylos. You have to bring her back, Alexios. Bring her back? We have our home again. We can be a family. It isn't too late. I'll bring her back, no matter what. This is serious, Alexios. We may not get another chance. I understand. She must have seen the cultists for what they truly are by now. It doesn't matter what you have to do. Bring back your sister. You must. Nothing will stop me. I shouldn't keep Rasitas waiting. Be safe, Alexios.
Come on. Where's Brasidas? What do you want with him? We fought together. A friend? Yes, and a friend of Sparta. Now take me to him. Stop! I have orders. Stand guard and wait for reinforcements. They were due two nights ago. You can stop waiting. I've arrived. You? The Athenians are dogs at our throats. You won't talk so tough once you see them. I join you, and all they'll see is the ferryman. Ha! Well met, warrior. You better fight as good as you talk. Come, we go to Brasidas.
and it is one you cannot win. If Rosidas dies, his blood is on your hands. He slaughters every one of your friends. Yeah. Are you mad? We can still stop. Enough! We will not stop. I don't want to kill you, Cassandra, but I will stop you. My name is Nemo. If we continue, one of us will die. Isn't that the point? I found Mata. Finally reunited, only to lose each other again!
don't know what you were thinking back there. What? Trying to save you? That's not what that was. I told you to stay out of my way. Yet here you are. So, what? I'm a prisoner until I'm killed? That's the plan. Or I could come in there and end you any time I please. But before that, tell me what you know. I thought your cultists told you everything. Sounds like you're on their side, but they're not on yours. You think I'm just a puppet? Then prove it to me. Tell me why I'm on the wrong side. Convince me. I dare you. What do you want to know? Everything you claim to be true. But after this, I kill you. Why was I abandoned that night on the mountain? It was the Pythia's prophecy. The Spartan Ephor said there was no other choice. A prophecy? You and I both know who feeds the Pythia her words. I do. A baby with a fate so terrible it was thrown off a cliff. What kind of prophecy would lead to that? The Pythia said you were going to bring Sparta to greatness or to its downfall. Waiting for the outcome was too big a risk. A risk? I heard you're unpredictable. I call it being decisive. You weren't decisive that night. You, my family, let me go. Let you go? You have no idea what happened on that mountain. Then tell me. No one told you that I tried to save you? I ran to catch you. I killed an elder. That ended my life too. Always trying to play the hero. It wasn't enough then, and it isn't enough now. I did everything I could. And I'm doing the same today. It's too late. There's nothing you could say to make me feel like family. Listen. After you and the Elder fell, they threw me off Mount Aegetos too. Pater, let me go. It was his duty. You were abandoned too. Yes. But we both survived. Against their wishes. We did. We're alive. Maybe it serves them right. Themos, we've been searching for you. And you are here. In the gutter. I hear it shouting. It's nothing. Leave. Now! This was not your action today, girl. I am not your puppet! And you are not my master. Of course, champion. Any discretion I won't repeat. <clears throat> Keep in mind, you put yourself in the cell. I don't recall doing that. You have to understand. This is all for Athens, Alexios. Pericles would have impoverished the entire city. The people were living in Squala. So you had him murdered? You can't find the perfect yog without breaking some of the quail's eggs. He wasn't right for us. Killing your adversaries proves what kind of leader you are. Oh, I'm just getting started. If only you'd be around to watch. Come into the cell. You're here to kill me, aren't you? Let's see what happens. Fortunately for me, there are other fires I need to extinguish. I have heard word of revolt. Already? That was fast. I have a plan. They can't revolt if they're dead. I don't know how you can take on a band of rebels if you refuse to fight this one. The act itself is out of my hands. The vote has been cast. What did I tell you? The people have given me their blessing. I use their power. That's not democracy. The people have chosen their destiny, Alexios. They've chosen me. 
Fuck you, Cleo. <laughs> I'm not alone in this. The people of Athens have spoken without me lifting a finger. That is how you treat rebellion. They don't know what they're agreeing to. You help me in Athens, even willingly. If only you were more like your sister now. A pity. The cult wins, Alexios. Now, I have to see about the boat heading to Mytilene. Its people are in for a rude awakening. <whistles> <laughs> Timing. Interesting. Death may be the greatest of human blessings after all. <sighs> At least you tried. Surely it's the thought that counts. Thank the gods you are alive, Alexios. If those guards are not the last, I say we need to leave and do so quickly. Wait, we need to talk about Cleon. Socrates is on to that Malacca. We know what he is doing. Be brief. His equipment for Navas. Come, for Navas. Alexios, meet us at Pericles' residence. There we'll discuss all we know. The steps to the Parthenon are long and built on corpses.
You made it. Of course I did. Barnavas was ready to go after you again. Like he said, it's the thought that counts, right? Apparently. Come, the others are waiting. We were worried you wouldn't make it. Especially with every Athenian guard looking for you. Cleon will have to do more than that to stop me. What's all this? We've begun working on a plan to take down Cleon. Although I hardly call it a plan. Lots of talking, not much action. It feels different without Pericles. But his inspiration lives on. That's why we're here. Where once we gathered to forget our problems, now we meet them head on. And get back to what truly matters. To restore Athens to its former glory. So you're taking down Cleon? Tell me the plan. It won't be simple. His death would disrupt the peace and be worse for Athens. He's right. We must discredit him first. Aristophanes apparently has some play he thinks will do the job. Some play? It is so much more than that. Oh, don't get your tunic in a twist. I just don't see why we can't all love each other. It's so much more fun that way. What's so special about the play? Will your famous orange ape impression be making an appearance? Ha! <laughs> Funnily enough, that was the inspiration. Isn't it a risk to show him in a bad light in front of his admirers? I think the play will change their minds. Good art is risky, but my plan will work. We can't just sit around. Cleon is sending a boat to Mitalini to kill the people there. The people trust Cleon. They'll vote for whatever action he puts forth. But that does not mean we plan to do nothing. Taking down Cleon won't be easy. But with your help, it will be possible. Ooh. 